Hello and welcome to Phoenix Cards and our weekly Pokemon opening. And today we are going to be opening this Pikachu V tin. Um, if you saw the video last Saturday, you would have seen me open the Eternatus V, which is in the background. And then possibly next week, um, I may be opening the EVV tin, which is the last in the trio. Though Champion's Path should be out, so that may be pushed back because obviously I do want to get Champion's Path opened on the channel for you guys. And I also want to collect that set in full because it's a holiday set. Um, so we're just going to focus on this Pikachu tin today. Said so it's one of the three tins. Uh, we do have a Pikachu V promo. And then on the back, it just tells us what we get inside. Basically the same as every tin. You get one of uh, three different promo cards. So for this, we've obviously got Eternatus V, Pikachu V, or EVV. We get four Pokemon booster packs, and we get a code card for the online game. So we're just going to get this open, and then have a look at the promo in close detail. And then we'll crack open the packs and hopefully get some good pulls for the video. So, our Pikachu promo is a Sword and Shield promo. Uh, 63, uh, 190 health, which is sort of around, sort of maybe average for a V. You would maybe hope for a little bit more. And then the, the attacks, we've got Pickable for one electric energy, 30 damage, which isn't great. And then we've got two electric energy for Circle Circuit. It does 30 damage for each of your bench Pokemon. Um, so it's not too bad. I mean, you're not going to be hitting massive numbers, but it's a cool little fun tech if you want to run uh, an electric deck. So we'll just sleeve the promo. And then we will get the packs. Okay, so we have the tin code, which you guys can have. And we'll just close the tin up that out the way a little bit. So the booster packs that we get are not packed very well. Um, we get Darkness Blaze times two, we get a Sword and Shield base set, and we get Sun and Moon base set. So I'm going to go from the oldest first. Obviously Sun and Moon, not the best set to put in there. Obviously it's rotated out standard. It's a very old set now because it's Sun and Moon base and we have like, we've built three sets now into Sword and Shield, so here's a very old pack to give you. So we have a Charger Book, Crushing Hammer, Herdia, Kavana, Snubble, Wingo, Lillipup, Cosmog, a reverse hollow crushing hammer, so that's quite cool because they've been reprinted so you can reuse these crushing hammers. And the rare is a non hollow incineroar. So the, the double crushing hammer is definitely the best things out of that pack. And there is a Sun and Moon co card, hopefully, you'll get something decent from that. And we have our base sword and shield pack. We have a Corvisquire, Thwacky, Pokemon Catcher, Ferroseed, Goldeen, Rosalia, Joltik, Silly Cobra, a Reverse Hollow Citrus Berry, and the rare is a non hollow Mudsdale. So, so far we are 0 for 2 on pools. We now have our two Darkness Blaze packs, got Charizard VMAX and Eternatus VMAX. We have a Simi Sage, Vanillish, Clang, Dino, Panseer, Mareep, Snubble, Tauros, a Reverse Hollow, Clang, and the rare is a Crobat V. That is an awesome pull, a very sought after card at the moment if you actually play the TCG. 
um, basically used in near enough every competitive deck, if not all of them, due to the ability Dark Asset. So that is an awesome pull. I'm very happy to get that, especially as I do need an extra Crobat for decks. And we can have a Sword and Shield code card. And on to our last Darkness Ablaze booster pack. Uh, remember guys, um, if you do like my videos, leave a like on the video um, down below. Uh, co comment. I always try to um, basically interact with all my viewers and people that leave comments and subscribers. And of course, make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell if you want to see further Pokemon TCG openings on Saturdays and other TCG openings or sort of random TCG stuff on Wednesdays. So our last Darkness of Blaze pack. We have a Furret, Yellhorn, Fluffy, Teddy Ursa, Panseer, Morlow, Wishy Washy, Kufan, a Reverse Hollow Dracovish, which is a rare, and the other rare is a non hollow Talonflame. So that was our last pack, just a quick opening today to continue with the trio of tins. Um, we obviously did get the Pikachu V promo and we got an awesome Crobat V half art pull from Darkness Ablaze. So I just want to say thank you guys for watching this video and for continuing to support the channel. Uh, make, again, make sure you subscribe to the channel so you know when new videos are uploaded. And until next time, I hope you guys have a good weekend.